Shalom, shalom, assalamu alaikum to the melanated family. This is the elder coming to you with another informative video. All praises to our creators and our ancestors. The family, this video is a individual video about this sister, Pearl Moore who is the greatest scorer in college basketball. We talking about college basketball. We ain't talking about the NAACC or the NAIA and all this nonsense that they're trying to prove to make somebody else something that they're not. We talking about college basketball. Doesn't matter what league you was in, we talk about college basketball. I'm going to play this little clip, and all my salute go out to Pearl Jones, because she is one of the greatest college basketball players. She is the greatest scorer of all time, 4,060-some points. We're going to play this little clip by this brother who came out with this information. The information and receipts are valid. If you ain't got no information, you ain't got no receipts, you know, it don't mean anything. Doesn't mean nothing. That's right, family. We're going to play this little clip right here. Peace and love. Get a hell of a few minutes. Sorry about that. But we're going to play this little clip right here. I want y'all to listen at it. Show your daughter how much you love her with this beautiful gift. He's in love. It says. With a man ball and with no three-point line. What if I told you, they told you for years, that this guy had the most points in college basketball history? Talk about but Pete Mavericks. And now in 2024, they're telling you that this young woman now has the most points in hmm. college basketball history. She doesn't. Let's see who really does. What it look like, TV. I am back. What it do, baby? YouTube's on Varnell Hill. Did you miss me? And we back, man. We got another episode. And today, we're going to get into why the NCAA has been lying to us and leading us on for the past couple months about who's the leading all-time scorer in college basketball. Hmm. But before we even get into it, this video was in no way to try to downplay Caitlin Clark. I think she's an unbelievable athlete. And the same with, with this video. We're not trying to downplay anyone. We're just telling the truth. Just like I said earlier in the video, this is about college basketball. Not, not the NACC or the NIA. Let's continue. I wouldn't go as far as to say I'm a fan of hers because I'm a fan of Peely. Peely, perfect. Peely, if you see this video, I need one of them Utah jerseys for the backdrop. Hook it mm. up, Peely. I'm rooting for you over here. But I think Caitlin Clark is going to have a hell of a career in the WNBA. And I think she deserves all her accolades, but we don't need to give her accolades that she don't deserve. Exactly. Because the person that has scored the most points in college basketball history is Pearl Moore. Pearl Moore scored 4,061 points playing from 1975 to 1979. Hmm. Now, a lot of people are saying, well, because she played for the AIAW, that she shouldn't be included in, in the NCAA record books. But the AIAW was the precursor to the NCAA for women's sports. Because before Title IX, the women had to have somewhere to play. And where they played and the flag that they played under was the AIAW. So just like with all the other sports, football, 
all the old AFL records before the merger, before the NFL and the AFL um, merged together, all those records are in the NFL record book. That's right. All the Negro League baseball players' records are in the MLB record books. If women had nowhere else, they couldn't play underneath the flag of the NCAA. Doesn't mean that their stats do not count. This woman played before women before the women's basketball was even created. She went out there and she dropped four thousand sixty-one points with a man ball and with no three-point line. There's the history. We talking about college. Basketball. We ain't talking about none of all this other nonsense. So that proves right there that they're taking, giving somebody something that they would, that they don't deserve. Peace and love. Put up the likes and shares, and I would love to hear how y'all feel about it, family. And I'm out. <laughs>